Everything evolves around the GCI Outdoor Slim Fold Cooking Station. This is a lightweight portable cooking station that we can put our Blackstone on it, we can prep our food on it, we can store supplies on it. What else can you ask for? So I'm going to start putting it together for you. Here's a table right here. As you can see, it's lightweight. I found it's easiest if we start on one side or the other. We're going to start on this side here. We're going to pull them out. You can see the lever's latch. And we've used this probably 40, 50 times so far. Had very good luck with it. So we started on this side, now we're gonna to get to the middle. You can see it's really easy. These we got aluminum cooktop here. Put the blackstone on. So everything evolves, everything evolves around this table. We got the prepping services. We got storage and storage down here. We have the blackstone. We got aluminum top. It'll take the heat of the blackstone. So let's go ahead and get everything else set up. The beauty of this blackstone is the fact that. It does have a gas connection that I can hook up to my quick disconnect gas on my RV. And I'm gonna show you how we do that. Disconnect, so we connect it. You slide into it, clicks. So we put this safety mechanism on so it won't pop off by accident. The screws on. We got our black, we got gas for a blackstone. Now that the blackstone set up, we'll put the griddle on it along with the, the lid and the drip pan. The drip pan goes in here. All right. Okay. Now that we've got the blackstone and the table set up, We'll add everything else that goes with our kitchen set up here, our preps, our cleaning supplies, and everything that we need to cook. Coming up next. I keep all my basic cooking supplies in this tote here, outdoor cooking only. I'll slide it in here like this. Slide it up. First thing I do is take out my paper towels. We got the paper towels set up. Next thing I do, I got my fireproof gloves. They go down here. I got some cooking oil. It always goes over here. One thing I do use, I do use this food service foil and they're in like half sheets, pre-cut. This is wonderful. Bought this from Costco. An outdoor knife that they keep outside. So that's my basic setup. I have another setup of spices that I keep inside the camper that I bring out when I'm getting ready to cook. All right, let's go on, let's move on. Okay, my cooking supply box. I have some uh, fireproof gloves, gun. I have an infrared gun to see what the temperature of the grill is. I have a small cutting board, fits right in here. Got my outdoor knife. Got my oil. Sits right there. Got my two spatulas. Got my two uh, spatulas. I set them like this. Keeps the handles cool. I don't know if they designed them that way or not, but it works. I usually use a av av avocado oil spray for when I need to, any oil. I have my timer. One of the unique things that I have is I have this food service foil from Costco. The nice thing about it is it comes in pre-cut sheets. So all I have to do is pull one out, 
or two or three out or whatever I need. Um, little waste and, and easy to do, especially when you're in a hurry and you're cooking. I usually set it down here. And then the other thing I have in here, I have a couple of uh, egg rings. Break the eggs, put them in there, and uh, very handy. That's the heart of my cooking station. Again, I got my grill, got my spatulas, I got my oils, I have a cutting board, got a knife, I got temperature gauge, just double check, heat proof gloves, foil, and a timer. It's awesome, guys, let me tell you, it really is. All right, now let's talk about cooking with my solo stove and a Dutch oven. Bought this little pyramid um, with chain. It's what I hate my Dutch oven for. I'll put, I'll put, every, put some of these links in um, the description below. Got my solo stove. Of course, I get my solo stove going, get it good and hot. Grab my Dutch oven, put it on there. Grab some coals and I put it on top. So here, here I can do my baking. I can do a cobbler, muffins, pizza, whatever you can think of here. And over there is my griddle. I can cook steaks, I can fry, I can do whatever I want to over there on a Blackstone. It's limitless if you put your imagination to it. So anyway, that's my outdoor kitchen. That's the way I use it. And we'll go into a little more in-depth detail about some of the specs. Okay, let's go into a little more in-depth about this GCI outdoor kitchen table. Number one, we got the aluminum top. It's fire, heat, fire resistance. You can cook, cook, cook your Blackstone on it. You have the, the outside wing tables. They snap in, fold up, and they're sturdy. The whole thing does fold up into a slim carrying one piece construction. It's easy to store, very easy to store. Okay, the top, 48 pounds you can put on. 30 pounds on these, these fold out tables. 35 pounds on the wire bottom shelf. And you also do have a shelf I mean, not a shelf, you have a place to hang your paper towels. This works. It's simple. It's easy to use. It's lightweight. It's compact. And it's, it's the heart of my outdoor kitchen. Would not be anywhere without it. I want to thank you for watching. If you like what you saw, give me a thumbs up. If you want to see more of it, go ahead and subscribe. I'm going to try and get more videos out like this. Until we meet around the campfire, you all take care now. Bye-bye.